Yo, 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 what up? So in this video, this is gonna be some narrative, some exposition, some like meaty dialogue that happens after you do this sequence where you set or she sets the Ur tree on fire. Right, rowdy sequence, tree gets lit on fire. So this was my first time, I had done this off stream, so I just recorded it. First time coming back to the round table after that and talking to NPCs, seeing it. You can obviously, if you look to the right, see that the uh, round table is on fire, it's ablaze. And these are some of the conversations you have with the people after that. You burned the earth tree, didn't you? Then the round table is soon to follow. Ah, no need to fret about that. The round table holds serve to put a tarnish upon the throne of Elven Lord. And if the earth tree needed to burn for that to happen, then the round table must go as well. There are four more demigods yet to be located. Mikola of the Halig Tree, the Unalloyed, his twin, Melania, the undefeated swordswoman, Luna Princess Rani, daughter to Renala, and the one only known as the Lord of Blood. Rani is said to have cast aside her great rune. So here at the Hold, we seek the whereabouts of the remaining three shard bearers. If you should learn anything of these matters, I'll trade your findings for a hidden treasure or a long lost right known only to me. We both desire to stand before the Elden Ring and become Elden Lord. As such, I hope we are compelled to work together. This is the same conversation uh, that he already had available. That's not new. I'll stay at the round table This for a is time. new. I must learn all that can be taken from this place and seal it into my memory. How could I call myself the all-knowing if I did any less? And then, so I wind up checking um, over here where the Dung Eater used to be and where the Twin Maiden was and there was nothing new, no new dialogue, no new NPCs or anything like that. Nothing new opened up. Then um, I run around here, nothing new. Eventually talk to her for the first time after burning the Take tree. A look around. The round table hold is burned, raised to the ground. Don't worry, I don't blame you. I'll continue spirit tuning just the same as before, which is why I need your help persuading Master Hugh to leave. His roots are so knotted in this place. He won't last much longer if he stays here. His shackles are broken. He's a free man now. It's high time he put the round table behind him. I knew you'd be back. Oh, and this is so after talking to her, I start walking over to homeboy and I immediately you'll see me do a double check. Watch double take. I'm like, what? Mm? Because I've walked to this guy so many times and that door at the end of the hallway is always closed. So of course I was like, okay, we're gonna definitely have to go look at that, which we'll get to in a second. I knew you'd be back. Lay out your arms. Let's get smithing. Weren't you listening? As I've always said, that you came to challenge the demigods and their god to slay them. And as long as you do, I will always smith your weapons. It is what I wish. To smith a weapon for you to slay a god. What a bar. What a homie. He's an absolute real one. Do, what a smith badass line. It is what I wish. To smith a weapon for you to slay a god. And then so of course I go and check what's up going on in this room. Great loot. And then I go and look and see if anything's changed downstairs, any new imp statues to use stone sword keys on. Um, nothing's new, no new NPCs, nothing like that. And then this was my first time talking to her after the um, 
setting the tree ablaze. You've done it, I see. What use do you have for me now? I am a finger reader. I will remain here until their dialogue ends and the thinkers speak again. Do as you please. Take whatever course seems most worthy to you. Now you may go. <laughs> <laughs> You'd force this tired old crone to work, even now. <laughs> ah, harder task master have I never met. And then, I I don't have enough runes to get the whip if I wanted to. The other option is an incantation down there. Um, we eventually look at this. The fingers are basically in hibernation mode right now. They're just chilling straight up. I go and drop down uh, where we first meet that like sorcerer dude. Nothing new, no NPCs, nothing like that. And then I eventually go to the tree to see if there's anything different here. And that's that. So this was, like I said, just a quick little video about the the dialogue and the exposition you get after setting the tree ablaze. Thanks for watching.